Hello, Pastor Steve Waldron here with New Life Pentecostal Church in Albany, Georgia, with one of my favorite indie authors, Ken Johnson. Uh, Ken has got a doctorate, a PhD, and he publishes his own books. That's what I mean by indie author. You know, he's just going around the system, sells it through Amazon, and he's done extraordinarily well. Various, you know, from the book of Enoch to the book of Jasher to the book of Jubilees to all kinds of, you know, the Nephilim, uh, doctrines of the early church, and on and on so forth. Now, I disagree with a lot of his theology and a lot of his basic theology. I have most of his books, if not all of his books. I think there may be one or two that I'm missing. Uh, this is one of my favorites. And I, I really like this subject. Those of you that have seen the Tower of Babel video by uh, Bodie Hodge know that I, I really enjoy this ancient post-flood history. And he's just done a masterful job marshalling different sources showing that Hercules was actually a real person. Um, you know, how did uh, Great Britain get its name? One place uh, I'll just read to you here, how did Pharaoh get his name? Rikon and all kings after him, were, after him were called Pharaoh, meaning Lord of the dead, or more literally, he who causes the dead to pay taxes. Rikon became the first Pharaoh of the second dynasty and began ruling from Elephantine. Now, note, Josephus says that astronomy was unknown in Egypt until Abraham brought it there from Chaldea. So you can see just little tidbits of information. Now, some of you might think some of his sources are a little questionable. Uh, like the book of Jasher, we might go into that at some time. But uh, overall, it's just almost a magisterial view in a very short package. It's not a real long book, easy read, good print. Uh, very well done. I like his, his marbleization on his cover and everything. A lot of inf uh, information, magisterial view of post-flood history. I think you'll find it fascinating and get some information that most of us probably didn't know in our common ancestry through Noah. God bless you today.